Okay, I just mulliganed an attempt at last stand. I tried to give it a go without Mercer. Oh boy, it was a disaster. Absolute disaster. Mercer, all is forgiven. I thought I might try giving it a run, you see, with um, a hunter. With the 7mm Harrier, because it can ignite targets. Um, wow, it, it just really brought home how valuable Mercer's leadership trait was. Because it, I just got killed instantly, pretty much. It was an absolute disaster. So, not having that again. Mercer is back in the mix. And we'll, uh, I think we can we can do a little bit better than wave seven. Mm, frustrating that those guys died to fire because I don't think, I don't think it maintains that sort of boost for the score multiplier. Okay, I really wanted to get a good angle on that tank so I could set him alight. There you are. So yeah, I went for a much more incendiary-based uh, squad last time. So that I would be able to set lots and lots and lots of targets alight. And it just... It's its not a patch on Mercer's natural ability. Now. Something that I didn't do in the last game. Was satisfyingly use the barrels. Yeah, wave three. Real early, what a waste, huh? But I just, I just hate when you complete this map and the barrels haven't been used. I think we got them all. Yeah, we did. Let's go here. Set you a light and start hitting you. Yeah, that beautiful, beautiful man at arms leadership trait from Mercer. You can see it kicking in there. Just, there is, there is no substitute, there really isn't. Hello boys. What we will do of course is use Russell's charge attacks frequently. Um, he is a shooter, therefore he only needs two charge attacks to be fully charged. And um, yeah, I mean obviously what he can do with those is set lots and lots of targets alight. That's what we kind of want to be doing. Ooh, do I want to use a charge attack here? Well, not really. I don't I don't think I need to. Certainly could, but I'd be I'd be attacking one target at a time. We're not in any kind of imminent danger. We wouldn't get an awful lot of value. In this instance though. I think in this instance that's a little more justifiable. The only thing is him, he's a risk. Let's do that. I wanted to get the kill there. Um, no, don't go there. Try and get these lads out of the way, and then we can focus on all of that stuff that's across the other side of the board. Nice. Get you cooking. How hurt are you? You're not going to die to fire this turn, are you? we go there? Yes, that seems like a big move, but yes, we can go there and be safe. Okay. Take you out of the picture. Kind of wanted that to be a kill, that's for sure. Uh...
potentially got a, a route of escape where Mercer is up and round. I think uh, we might have to take that. Now I'm concerned about him. We'd need to we'd need to cripple you. We'd need to stun you or something. How are we going to do this? Do we punch through you? Well, we've got reinforcements coming in next turn, so that's not really an option either. Oops. Fudge. Well, that was a misclick. Okay, I absolutely hate this. I really, really hate this. We're going to keep you charged. Can we finish you off? Not even close. Okay, thank goodness. Now that's what I was concerned about, was where the uh, reinforcements were going to come, be coming in. That could have been horrific. It really, really could turned out kind of okay so good yes we, we kind of had to get the stun there got it set you on fire you need to be ignited you need to be ignited so let's do that okay 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 this is looking good Every single turn, their health is chipping away because they are on fire. Well, except for you. Can I get you and be safe? Oh boy, no, I can't. Okay, let's just... Let's hit you. Let's hit you. Good, they're both on fire. That's exactly what we wanted. Hit those guys with Mercer. He is the right man to hit, be hitting that, uh, that spiky. Should die to fire. Great. Fantastic. Yeah, everyone's everyone's cooking. Um we're in a we're in an okay sort of safe-ish position at the moment. Looking good. Okay, let's just keep on hitting these bad guys. Good. Gun okay, needed him on fire. Let's make sure that everybody is out of range. I'm gonna assume that the cripple is gonna kick in. There's there's like a 95% chance that if we hit something, the cripple will kick in. Can we uh right, we need to be using you to set things on fire. Good. Yeah, even even sort of standard walkers are worth, you know, considering setting on fire. I think uh, we use a nice tasty charge attack against these guys from Mercer. Cause some extra damage. Shove these guys back with Rufus. We're just trying to buy some time. You know, I, I do want to set these guys alight because they can they could be problematic if we don't. Really can, they're just normal walkers, but don't underestimate them ever. Okay, we're splitting our forces, we're splitting our fire. That's not something I'm crazy about doing. I think what I'm gonna do here. Yeah, I am going to hold on to that charge point. I am going to hold on to that charge point. I think these guys, they still need to be getting hit. They could still potentially be a problem. You, sir, really need to be on fire. Okay, well, rooting you, that, that buys us some time. That's, that's kind of an okay state of affairs. Glad I didn't use Rufus's charge point. I was sorely tempted to. But, uh... 
kind of worked out okay. Let's just keep on smashing these guys. Move to the back. We've got some reinforcements coming in. Double-edged sword, of course, means there's more bad guys on the uh, uh, screen. But it means that we get charge points, which is lovely. Okay, maybe actually I should be focusing more down here. If the reinforcements for the next turn are coming from the top of the screen, I'm probably going to want to be retreating to the bottom of the screen, aren't I? Let's give these guys a nice little love tap. I'm probably going to be looking to fight our way through these guys first. I'm happy that I've got Rufus's charge attack. We should have Mercer's charge attack. Yeah, there we go. These these guys are, are closing in to seal our doom. We can do some fun stuff like that. I think. Thing is, if I put you there, can he still get you? Yes, he kind of can, can't he? Um, nice big charge attack from Mercer there. We're going to have to... Yeah, I mean, we've got, we've got some real problems right here. We haven't got a, a free sort of... We haven't got anywhere where we can readily retreat to, which is a huge problem. We've got bad guys here, we've got bad guys here. <sighs> you know, and they are... Yeah, they are definitely, definitely a problem. I mean, depending on where the bad guys spawn from. When the reinforcements kick in, we could really be in trouble. Gonna have to move Mercer there or else he's gonna get chewed on by somebody. Well, that's not very good for us, is it? I mean, I'm not too sure what I can do here, really. Um, I can stun that. Metalhead, you know, I can I can kind of do this if that helps. Does it? I can't. Yeah, basically, I'm really really struggling here. I don't think that's going to have wound up helping us too much. Yeah, Mercer's getting chewed on. Dog, do your thing. get a good lot of targets by doing that. I mean, Mercer is in some big trouble right there, and I think, I think we might find him getting killed next turn. Nope. Oof, Russell's turn to, to get up close and personal with a walker this time. Okay, so he is, he's let go. He's rooted. But of course, um... He can still attack, well, Rufus if I leave him there. Russell is stood next to him. He's just going to instantly start chewing on his face. Let's uh, let's just do this. Everyone's in the red. Every single person. Huge dramas here. I don't think that this is going to be a uh, uh, game-breaking score that we're going to set here. Not by any stretch of the imagination. I think Russell uh, could wind up dead here. Nope, good defensive shooting. We just... Bless him, we just can't hit that... Tank hard enough to stop him from biting on Rufus. One more turn of this and Rufus is gone. And we're just going to wind up with a... It, it's not a great score. Let's face it, that is that is pretty poor. Mercy, you champ. Fighting till the last. Would 
I would expect nothing less, but uh, yeah, good effort, mate, good effort. Oof, lovely. <laughs> yeah, well, that ain't gonna last for very long, is it? I can't get through, I can't get through anybody. Yeah, well, I wanted to just try that last little bit at the end, see if that was gonna have an effect. I mean, wave 18 is okay. That's not a fantastic score. Slightly disappointing end to this run of last stands, but hey, it's only the Commonwealth armor that's up for grabs. <laughs> at least we did. At least we did better than that. That was awful. Really, actually, quite pleased with this score now. I mean, because my gosh, this last stand is difficult. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed it though, and as ever, thank you for watching.